So this is something that we've kind of had an, on our radar for a few years, but it's a pretty large investment and we didn't really have a great place to put it until the erection of the pavilion. And so we weren't, it wasn't really on our radar for 2020, but a board member brought it up to us again and we thought, you know what, 2020 is the year to do it. There's been so much disappointment uh, because of cancellations and just COVID in general that we thought this would be a great year to bring a, an attraction like this to the community that people could really look forward to, do as a family, keep it outdoors in case COVID cases do continue to rise. We worked with uh, a company called Perfect Parties USA who have um, a, a flagship company underneath them called, called Artificial Ice. and. It is a company that we've been in contact with for a couple of years as we tried to explore this opportunity. And it is all encompassing. They bring down the ice, they bring down the fencing, the solution, the skates. Uh, they bring down a sharpener for the skates. So if the, sharp, if the skates get dull, we, have a, we actually have a sharpener on the back of the trailer to, to sharpen the skates with. Um, they provide um, uh, shoe spray for the shoes so that we can um, disinfect those in between skaters. They provide everything. It's all encompassing. It is plastic, but it does, uh, it is slick just like ice. And so if you have ice skated before, it's going to feel very similar to ice. It might have a little bit more drag to it, um, but if you've never skated, we do have buckets for you to lean on and learn on. Um, those were donated by Heartland Building Center. They donated 50 buckets and so then we can stack them up to the correct height so kids that are learning can lean on those and, and learn how to, to kind of balance themselves before uh, going without it. If it does go over the way we think it's going to go over, then we can look into purchasing it and making it a permanent installation every winter. But for now, it's just here until February 28th, and then the company will come and pick it back up from us.